Hello everyone, I'm back for another update. Now some of you may be able to tell that I got a new stand for my camera, so I'm not gonna have to physically hold my camera myself anymore. So, good news. Now, some of you may know that the last few videos that I have out were filmed with me physically holding the camera myself. Now, to be honest, I don't think they actually turned out all that bad, considering that they were handheld. Of course, if I don't have to physically hold the camera myself, that's all the more convenient. So, there's good news, and I do have some other good news, and that good news would be that part one of Interesting Story I finish uploading and editing. Now here's the not as good news. There's gonna be a delay in me uploading it because my dad really wants to view the video before I upload it. And the reason for that is my dad isn't sure if that would really be an appropriate video for me to upload. Now there isn't anything inappropriate in it like sex, nudity, violence or anything that would violate the YouTube's terms of service policy. That's not the reason why my dad finds the appropriateness of it questionable. It's just my dad isn't sure if that would really be a respectable thing for me to include on my YouTube channel. However, I promise you all that it will be uploaded sooner or later. I just can't promise exactly when, but it will be uploaded. It's just a matter of when, and it's not a matter of if. I have scripts for other videos written out, and I also have ideas for YouTube videos that I will plan on writing very soon. YouTubing is my job now. I spend a great deal of my time writing, composing, editing, and filming videos. When I'm not filming a video, I'm usually either writing a script or I'm thinking of ideas for another YouTube channel. Um, now, having a YouTube channel, I will admit, does take a lot of work. It really does take a lot of work to do all this. However, even though YouTubing is a lot of work, I will admit that I still really love this hobby and I'm glad that my dad suggested this hobby to me. Um, and yes, it's actually true that my dad was actually the one who gave me the idea to start my YouTube channel. I can't remember if I ever mentioned that in any of my previous videos, but it is true that my dad was the one who suggested that I start my YouTube channel, and I was planning on describing that in more detail in the interesting story and in the following video that I plan on putting out after part one of the interesting Else story. that I wanted to share was that I got into a new TV show. I'm sure many of you have seen or have heard of it before. It's called Skins. I know, it's 2022 and I just now got into Skins. I've only watched the first season so far, and I absolutely love it. I have a huge crush on Sid Jenkins. I find him absolutely adorable. His awkward mannerisms send me into a fangirl bliss overload. I don't think there are many Skins fans that don't have a crush on him. I was thinking of possibly making an AMV or something on it in the future. I remember when I was in middle school, anime AMVs were the shit. I remember I would watch the Naruto AMVs all the time when I was in like seventh grade. I'm sure I'm not the only one who had an anime AMV kick in 7th grade. I'm sure many of you did too. And I can accredit anime AMVs for getting me into the rock and metal genre. That was actually how I actually discovered the whole rock and metal genre from the Naruto AMVs because they were everywhere at that time and they often had lots of like really good iconic rock songs. So that inspired me to become a metalhead. So Thank you to all the anime AMVs in middle school for planting that seed in me. One thing that I was planning on getting done is professional cool sculpting. Now, I actually have a cool sculpting device at home, and I've used it on and off for seven months. And this is what it looks like, and it was only $100, so I'd say for its low price, it definitely does something. And now that I have some money saved, I did some research and I managed to find some places in my area where I could get cool sculpting done. And I was just planning on having my mom review those places and have her help me decide which place to get it done at. So 
in the future, I may also make some videos documenting my progress with cool sculpting and also my diet and exercise routine that I do in conjunction to achieve natural weight loss with my cool sculpting. To conclude this video, I just wanted to say that I have some YouTube videos filmed and others written out. I'm sorry for the delay and I will get to writing more soon. Now, some other good news is that the June of 2022 was a really good month for my YouTube channel. There was a time in that month where I got four subscribers in 24 hours. I got more subscribers in that one day than I did in all of 2021. Um, in the first year of my YouTube channel, I only got three subscribers in that whole year. Hey, we all gotta start somewhere. I don't uh, stress or get myself worked up over my subscriber count. I feel that defeats the purpose of why I have my YouTube channel. Ultimately, I have my YouTube channel to express my feelings and viewpoints on things, uh, to share my story, and to educate others on topics like mental health. And so I really don't get myself worked up over my subscriber count, and I don't think anyone else that runs a YouTube video should either. Well, that's all I have for today. Happy 4th of July, and I'll see you all soon.